Welcome back, Attractive and Well Educated Watchers, to a brand new episode of Empires of the Undergrowth. Last time we left off, we tried the brand new Fire Ants. This time, we're going to take them for their second mission. So, if you're excited to see what happens today, remember to like, subscribe, do all those other lovely things that help support the channel. Go on down to our link tree, link in the description. Find all the other places that we do stuff. Support us there. Share this video anywhere you can. And if you're an especially attractive and well educated watcher, go on down to our Patreon via that link tree, link in the description. And pledge even just $1 a month to help support the cause and join the mighty, mighty ranks of Mike the Microphone, our number one patron of all time, and Tall Pans are our number one watcher of all time, and get your name in the game, that's right, this game. Wait, no, wait, maybe not this game. Definitely a game. So, without further ado, let's get to it. <clears throat> let's continue the Golden Empire. Yes, good. For these silly raptor ants. Between the break, just because uh, it took a little bit of time, we got a whole entire functioning thingamabob of shooty girls... A functioning thingamabob of food storage, and an extra large 30 functioning thingamabobs of big girls. And after that, we're going to tear this area out, get the food, raise it one more layer, and then work on some fiery girls. Alright, but before we do that, you know, and we've got everything already as you can see, so before we do that, let's, uh, let's go to 4.2, 4.2, a bridge too far. We'll just do the basic, uh, good stuff first. We will have our pervasive ants dealing with it. So we can have two ants for every tile. Nice. Fire ants are cool. Fire ants are pretty cool, eh? Okay. Last time was pretty fun. Probably could have done a little bit faster. I think we're going to try to do a little bit faster this time around. So, yeah. Let's do this, Leroy Jenkins. Stoked. Oh, okay. Grow, grow colony population. Workers are worth less. On her nuptial flight, finally landing atop a sandy mound deep in the swamp. The vantage point might seem like an ideal home, but it may be short-lived. Mm. This whole area is liable to flooding, and nearby rainfall is already causing the groundwater to rise. Exhausted and without her wings, yep. the queen is unable to move on alone. But if she can amass enough daughters in time, the colony as a whole may stand a chance. Maybe. Oh, jeez, that was close. This is all pine nuts and stuff. At least that's what we were led to believe. Okay, they are pine nuts and stuff. Good. Oh, that's bad. We didn't like that. We did not like that one bit. No, we did not. At all. Alright, prepare the food. Alright. Yeah, you know, those things look especially bad. Food is abundant, but as the flood water begins to rise, the ants will quickly lose access to the lower lands. It's true. Good God, what is that thing? Okay. It's bad, that's what that thing is. It's bad. A great blue skimmer, Liba Lula Vibran. Eesh. Vibran's hunts overhead. This fantastic aerial predator shouldn't uh, pervasive fire ants, okay. Any trouble for the ants. That is, unless it decides to land in their way. Right. Shouldn't cause any trouble for the ants unless it wants to. Many nearby creatures have already been washed out of their homes by the rising water. A lucky few have been deposited on the shores east of the nest. As more arrive, tensions will rise. There isn't space here for everyone. Well... It do be like that sometimes, man. All 
Don't worry. Slowly but surely, we're gonna take care of this. Okay, just go to this pine cone real quick instead. That'll be fine for now. Alright, big population. Big population. That's our goal right now. Yeah, actually, let's just do that. While we slowly but surely build up our totals. Once we get a proper cell, it'll all be great. Alright. Pushing forward. Good. Ha <laughs> ha ha! Twelve is good. It's not quite good enough, though. And as the night falls, that's when we'll start making our move. Good. More. Get back to the queen. Because there is a claim of creatures attacking. That means queen. But eventually we might have a worker group just for her. The earth at the base of the mound is now saturated. Oh no! It's now saturated, and as night approaches, the water begins to creep closer. The new arrivals will rush to higher ground, heading straight for the nest. There is nowhere else to go. Quickly, quickly then! Queen is in imminent danger. One more, and then another. And then we finally, with the last one, finish our thingamaburple. False bombardier. Uh, the of panicking creatures are larvae of the false bombardier beetle. Already large and accomplished predators, they will hold their ground against small groups of ants. Yeah. But not well enough, clearly. All right. 
An ant has fallen victim to a carnivorous plant. Is there anywhere else we can go? We're just wildly checking around here. Great if we knew where the hell we were going. Okay, well, one moment. The inundation has slowed, and fewer creatures are washing up to the east. The ants have an opportunity to explore for food, but there are other dangers at night. Moist skinned amphibians have come out to take advantage of this new water world. Harvesting lost insects displaced from their burrows. Alright, two seconds. Where are you going, dude? see what's going on here. That's not gonna work though. Instead what we're gonna do is bust through and break on through to the other side. Get the tasty! Yes! There will be much tasty here. All we must do is kill and capture it. And then, once we get this to third, then we will be able to start upgrading our numbers. Yes! Now we have 20! And it will keep going, just like that. Well, we can stay in, in the colony overnight just fine. Because we have plenty of things to uh, clear out. The ants must fight. Take it down, ladies. Spicy girls. Ha ha! Now expanding our group totals. Impressive gains. And now we very much are starting to increase our practical territory. Intruders in the nest. Intruders? Nah, just food, man. Mwaha!
Oh yeah! Very much what we want. Then we can slowly start building up. Carry it all back. Upgrade our food stores to improve these food stores. Go back for that later. Still night time. Kill all of these things. Scour the area for food. Go back this way. Make a ring of workers, as we almost always do. Fruit is in the nest. Go kill those fools. Uh, crush them. Water rises again. Now we make even more brood, we guess. Yeah, just fire ant brood tile. Kill that thing. Tree frog. It's tree frog. Gila femoralis has wandered into the trail. This one has taken a break from mate. This one has died. And it seems that ants are on the menu. What do you mean? Seemed like frog was on the menu. Definitely gonna roll out over here. We have enough now to bully anyone who gets in our way. Continued rainfall is about to bring another torrent flushing through the bog, carrying with it a slew of ill-tempered arthropods. Nobody cares! We are a slew of ill-tempered arthropods! You don't want to mess with us. Alright, that'll be our next. Here they come. That's an actual bombardier beetle. An ant has found itself entangled on the sticky tentacle of a dwarf sundew. Yeah. As it tries to struggle free, more tentacles are drawn in. Doesn't really matter. The victim in thick mucilage. Mucilage. That's a nice word. All right. Crack out more. Must be protected. The returning champions will take them down, There's not enough and then continue.
Don't worry, that too is also fine. There we go. The end Looking to the death. Oh, what do we got here? Yeah, this one will take it down. As we said, it's fine. We do have a, a degree of power here. And Kablam! Quality 90s Nickelodeon Entertainment. Ha! Food! Predators are loose in the nest. The larvae must be protected. You mean food's loose in the nest? That's what it looks like to us. Food. Loose in the nest. One down, two to go. Here we go. And once the first one falls, they all end up falling. Alright. What next we got? Tear it apart. Go collect what you can as fast as possible. Oh, really? That's... Oh, wow. The workers have done all they can to... All right, well... Stores. There are some beetles in the way, but don't worry. They will be eaten quite quickly. Like, right there. Kablam. That bug is done. Kill those things. Come on. Keep upgrading the food stores. Oh. Yeah. Hey, look at that. Boom. Okay, were these the attacking creatures you speak of? Doesn't seem too scary. Attack, creature attack. to drain the flood water creeps ever nearer to the nest already cramped and irritated a panic ensues and the refugees scramble for higher ground ha and the ants must fight we can take whatever you got Take the big one down! Don't let her get to the queen! Keep it up! And keep this up, too! The 
Yeah. Yeah. Twelvers. Oh, that'll be taken care of quite quickly. Get those Twelvers out. It's a frog! Allow better surround and destroy avenues. Continue mass upgrade. We will get over a hundred fire ants. It'll be great. Looks like that frog went down. Good. Should we... I mean, we kind of have to... If we... Okay, whatever. You know what we need to do? Let's just invade their nest. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Saved by the pine nut. ...spread across the swamp. With growing numbers of amphibians patrolling the waters, the Invictors' scavenging expeditions will need to be well defended. Okay, whatever. High health, high attack, poisonous skin. Huh. Oh, in that case. Notofalmus viridations is devouring ants. Growing up to 10 centimeters in length, it dwarfs Yeesh. on the mound. Its red skin is toxic and serves as a warning to potential predators. Is it? Okay, no it isn't. Little black ants marooned on a smaller section of the mound may be reachable if the fire ants join together to bridge the gap. Teamwork! Ha <laughs> ha! And the traffic continues. Here they go. The Already the fighting. Defend themselves. defend themselves? We're the ones invading. What are you talking about? Crush them! And the fight begins. The highway effect is now. Yup, turn him up! Oh, and the queen's right here! So she's like, all in our way. Take her down, ladies! The little black ants have been defeated. The fire ants must pillage the nest quickly and hurry home oh, yeah. while they still can. Yeah, pillaging's very necessary here. Take all of the eggs you can. All the brood you can. Get in, get everything, get out. hoo Okay. Alright, food stores. Don't worry. The ants are still gonna be doing their ant things. In fact, we're just coming back for our second route. 
And the first thing we're gonna get is do is upgrade the big ones. As is appropriate. So soon. This one, then this. And these will actually get directly give us extra ants. Alrighto. Over a hundred ants now. That's pretty nice. Yup. Gotta do everything possible. We love the we love the pontoons and the bridges, it's cool. I we just think they're neat. Yup. Here they come, by the dozens. Okay. Oh, back to this. Stealing all yo eggs before the water rises. As one does. All these ants, look at them. Spicy girls taking care of business. Getting stuff done. This is a good nest, too. Jeez. Alright. And it's looking like we already have folks coming back. Already crossing over. Good, good. Nothing left. Venture down this away then. They should actually probably be able to get everything. Should be getting ladies coming in any second now. Cobblam, here we are. Perfect. Now we're having a proper interchange, officially. Look at that. We love that highway effect. The in and the out, the the transit times, and so on and so forth that ants do. It's cool. We, again, we just think they're neat. Almost got our population all the way up to where we need it to be. Hey guys, get out of there. Like now. We have a feeling that once the water rises, this area won't be there. Just a feeling. But, uh, you know... We'd rather nobody die, in case that happens to, you know, be what goes down. Oh, look at that! Just like we thought, it was indeed exactly what we thought was going to go down. Alright, well, in that case... Come on down and eat this thing. Veneera, more insects begin to wash up on the bank. The Invicta colony must maintain control or risk being overrun. Psh. Yo, okay, we are not really worried. Our population is pretty darned high. As you can see, we're coming in. The battle. We see no battle. Oh! Pardon! Huh. 
Haha! <laughs> Let's just push this population up to our maximum. The battle has begun. And scatter at the top of the hill. There are intruders in the nest. Who? Oh no! My god, it's a worm! Oh yeah. Crush them ants. An ant has fallen victim to a carnivorous plant. Nobody cares. Oh man. So much carnage. Nature is so metal. Yup! Here we go! Hey, let's just go kill this guy! There are intruders in the nest. Oh no! Ooh! Oh, we're supposed to gather all of our ants at the top of the hill. Okay, fair enough. The ants must fight. Gather all of our ants at the very top. Okay, so once they get there, then we'll gather them all up. Right here at the top. Oh, no, here at the top! No doubt to try to pontoon our way away. Alright. So we simply must gather enough, clearly. We have gathered enough. By joining their bodies together to form yes! A giant raft. Raft! Yeah, they're gonna raft away! From the mound, just as the nest filled with water. Just in time. Over, but they've shown great ha ha! To survive in this harsh environment, wherever they land, the creatures of the swamp will quickly come to know the might of the fire. Oh yeah! Now we are, of course. Actually, we'll probably get extra territory here because we're pretty good on food. And that pretty much fills out our thingamabob today. It was pretty fun. If you liked what you saw today, remember to like, subscribe, do all those other lovely things that help support the channel. Go on down to our link tree link in the description. Find all the other various different places that we do stuff. Support us there. Oh, it doesn't matter. Ventilation. Terrible down here. The stuff builds up in the corners. I'd put in a complaint. If you're up to something, oh dear. We'll find out. Up to something. Up to something. How why? Why? to make the place a little bit tidier. I clean the desks inside. Yeah. I'm up to something. Up to something. Oh, very nice, very rich. Up to something. Very golem of him there. My raptors, on the other hand. <laughs> oh jeez. This guy, he bad. This guy, he bad. Yeah, so, uh, sorry, got cut off there. If, uh, if you liked what you saw today, remember to like, subscribe, do all those other lovely things that help support the channel. Go on down to our link tree link in the description. Find all the other various different places that we do stuff. Support us there. Share this video when you can. And if you're an especially attractive and well-educated watcher series, so consider going on down to our Patreon via that link tree link in the description. Find out, er, uh, and some pledge even just one dollar a month to help support the cause and join the Mighty Mighty Ranks. I'm Mike the Microphone, our number one patron of all time, and Toll Pans are our number one watcher of all time. Get your name in the game. Maybe not this game, but definitely a game. Thanks a bunch for coming, everybody. Stay safe, stay inside, stay healthy, and of course, remember to help each other. Bye!